How's it going? I'm Connor and welcome back to another installment of Versus where I take two fast food restaurants, pit them against one another, and see which one is better in my opinion. Remember, just my opinion. So our two burger chains we're going to be comparing is Wendy's and Burger King, which Burger King recently came out with a brand new burger called the Bacon King, which is practically a Baconator. So I had a genius idea of why not compare them and see which one is better. Is the original better or the copycat better? So we're going to be judging them on three different criterias, the price, size, and then taste, which the taste category consists of the taste of the bacon, the taste of the burger patty, and then the taste, well, overall taste so that is a total of five points up for grabs which one's going to be better i have no idea but let's get started let's go looks like wendy's has a whole bunch of new stuff taco salad might have to try that one yes i'd like one baconator that's all baconator, yes ma'am all right thank you Six seventy-three. dollars One burger. Jeez. How are you doing? Good, how about you? Nice. How oh, dare they? Have a nice day, babe. Alright, thank you. All right, so we're parked. We have our Baconator in the bag, and it seems the receipt was actually in the bag. $6.73 for just the sandwich. Seems kind of pricey, but I guess it makes sense. I think it'll be cheaper at Burger King, honestly. And I really love, I'll say, I'll say it right off the back, I really love Wendy's burgers. I think they have some of the better fast food burgers, but I also, not to be biased, I also really love Burger King. That's these are one of my favorite places to go to anytime I want fast food. So I think both of them are going to be good. It's going to be hard to decide which one's better. And I love Baconators. It's been so long. And look at that. Look at that. I'll say it again. Look at it. <laughs> I, I, oh, man, that looks so good. And let's pop the top up. So we have three bacon strips on top. Beef, ketchup, and a mayonnaise. Cheese, more beef, and more cheese at the bottom. Brand, grand total of six slices of bacon. It's been so long since I've had one of these. Bun, really soft. Meat looks really fresh. The size, I'd say pretty decently sized. That's what she said. And let's see how it tastes. Mmm. Getting some crunch from that bacon. The bacon is cooked perfectly just how I like it. Super crispy, really flavorful. The bacon, the bacon, the beef patties, super juicy. They're a fourth pound patty. And I think Burger King's is the same exact way. And they're so cheesy. The bread's so soft. Ketchup and mustard, uh, ketchup and mayonnaise just makes it so much better. The creaminess from the mayonnaise and the ketchup. You can't make a better burger. I think Burger King has a hard competition. This is a good burger. I'll say it again, Wendy's has good burgers. I think Burger King is has some hard competition here. I do like Burger King, I have full confidence in them, but let's head there and see how their sandwich holds up to the Baconator. I like Burger King. Yes, I'd like one of the Bacon Kings, just the sandwich. Anything else? And that is all. Thank you, that wrong. $5.99 before tax. Told you it was gonna be cheaper. Well, with tax, it might be more. Who knows? Hi, six six two. How you doing? Good. How about you? Thank you. Told you it was gonna be cheaper. All right. Thank, thank you. Thank you. you too. Oh man, seems heavy. We are parked and at Burger King. And now we'll compare the prices. The price for the Bacon King was $6.62 and Wendy's was $6.73. So by 11 cents, Burger King gets the point and is already in the lead. 
And for the burger, and surprise to me, I thought it was gonna be like the size of a double stack, you know, those little small dollar burgers you get at Burger King, but this is a full-blown Whopper with two patties and I think four slices of bacon and cheese and stuff. So, uh, with size-wise, let's compare them now. A size comparison, I would have said Burger King was probably a little bigger, and then the Burger King one does seem like it weighs a lot more, so I'll give the size point to Burger King. So it seems like it is a 2-0 right now. So now I'll give you a close-up of the Burger King one. This seems like the good side. And we have the toasted sesame seed bun. Pop the top up. Let me take a peek. Looks like all the bacon is at the top. We have ketchup and mayonnaise, cheese, beef, cheese, and then more beef. So let's go in for a bite. And seems like it's gonna be good. I didn't realize, but they put a ton they put a ton of ketchup and mustard, which I'm not complaining. I really like ketchup. I always put tons of ketchup on my burger. Mayonnaise, I could kind of live without, but it's like drenched in ketchup and mustard, making it almost like too messy. So I'll be honest, like I always am, but the flavor of the Bacon King is actually pretty good. I was kind of skeptical coming into this. I seen somebody do a review on this and they said it was amazing. And I was like, this, this won't be good, but it actually, it's pretty good. I won't deny that one. When I took my first bite, I got all that flame broiled burger patty flavor, which I think their burger patties taste better at Burger King than at Wendy's. Wendy's, they don't really have a whole lot of flavor to them. I'll take one more little bite of theirs. It doesn't even taste like there's like salt or pepper on it. So another point for beef patty, we'll go to Burger King. So it looks like 3-0, looks like Burger King wins automatically, seems now. But I mean, we still have two other points, so we'll see how that goes. But, the big old but, uh, the bacon to me is not, not crispy. I, I got this right away and I ate it really fresh, it's super hot. The bacon, not crispy, it's soggy. When I think of bacon from Burger King, I always thought of sad, not crispy bacon. And that came through in here, the bacon, is not good, so the bacon point, Wendy's, for sure, their bacon was 20 times better. And the other downside, you could probably see from that side, all that ketchup and mayonnaise, and then all the ketchup and mayonnaise on this side, there's just too much sauce that I think if they would have gone a little lighter on ketchup and mayonnaise, I think this one, the overall flavor would be better, but I don't think so. I will take one more bite of this one and then one more bite of the Wendy's for I could have a side-to-side -side comparison and tell you which one actually tastes better overall. Mm -hmm. And then the final bite of Wendy's Baconator. Wait, and the point for overall flavor goes to, wait for it, Wendy's. Both of these burgers are fantastic tasting burgers. It's just that I find the Baconator has a slight edge over the Burger King Bacon King. <laughs> but I think Wendy's the burger tastes better, but point wise, uh, looks like Burger King is the winner of this versus a total of three points for Burger King and two points for Wendy's. But ultimately, Burger King wins. And in the comment section below, let me know if you've tried the Baconator or if you tried the Bacon King and let me know which one you think is better for you could join in debate as well. So thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed this video and you liked it, make sure to hit that like button. And if you're new here and not subscribed yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button and watch any of these other videos if you haven't watched them already. But that's it for me and I'll see you guys next time on my next video. Connor out.